and now we have Gadwin. Look at that. Level 30. He is truly on me and man. And new enemies. The Rock Man. Now we're still training weapon skills here. But now we'll get to see how powerful Gadwin is. And it is a really, really cool style. Look at that. One shot. Doesn't even care. Oh, I just really, really enjoy him as a character. He just has this air about him. Like, he is your battle hardened warrior. He's tough, he's strong. There we go. 19,000 to level him up. Well, I reckon we're going to have to give him to max level before we stop, aren't we? Oh, where am I? There we are. Use this just to improve Justin's strength out a little bit more. Oh, I can't remember where I am. I think I've came the wrong way, that's why. There we are. A chest! My initiative. Now you guys see Gadwin's turn on these. Absolute monster, he does just so much more damage than everybody else. It's like double just then. It's just so insane. <laughs> there we are. Justin's nearly got his level, uh, his weapon skill up too. I'm not gonna use that. I just want to be able to unlock his moves and Fina's, I guess, while we're at it. Go on, smack it. There we go. Oh, I guess we're getting there. Uh, we've got space for items again. Didn't happen before, obviously, so it's pretty hype. I think even Sue can take these out in one shot, you know. There we go. Shame Sue didn't get a chance. She just, uh, she just whiffed. Big fights. You know, God will hit the slip holes. Phoenix can go for a red devil. Easy. What a fish. We're gonna slow again there. And another fire. Yeah, I think uh, Sue actually can do more damage than Fina. Through just normal attacks. Fina's much better with uh, spells and stuff though, so. Like, it sort of evens out. Like, Sue's best at just doing, like, uh, stuff like that. Oh, 
She got a... She got some XP from that machine, right? Might just be able to one-shot them. That was a god move from the first one. Yeah. Because his reach is so far too, because he's like twice the size of all of them. Such a man mountain. I thought there was an item there that I missed. Nope. Here's a few fights. But yeah, in general, as long as you like switch your weapons and stuff like that, like you'll pretty much always be able to level up. Uh, like all your all your characters to be strong enough just to fight anything, because the uh, difficulty spikes. Like I think the curve is nice. What a cinch. While some games have like a really like steep curve, and it gets like you've got to keep grinding. This one doesn't really. It doesn't really have that as much. I think that's what makes it like really good. I mean, there's a lot that makes the game good, but that does really help. So Can Sue take out the Red Devil in one? Yes. Oh, Sue, so strong. All right, we won. It's insane, actually. There we go. Through this way. Please go. Oh, oh, I knew that I would miss something if I didn't look properly. You can't be missing mana eggs. Oh. I'm so dumb. I like get confused. It's okay though. Yon is playing Animal Crossing New Horizon. I don't. I've never really looked through the settings. I do want to turn it off. It does get in the way when I'm trying to do like other things. You're no match for me. And I'd like it to not be there, but I've never really checked you. Oh, was it through that way just to get the item? I wasn't sure. The best part about these is that Fina can do it in one rotation. Sue does, Sue does lots of damage, <laughs> like, oh my god, she does lots. She's now got mass skill as well. Let's go. She's got no HP, like. I think that's part of the problem. She has 64 HP. You're no match. Bad win. Just takes absolutely no prisoners. Oh, Justin did get hit in there. I was worried he didn't. But luckily, that was not the case. Straight up. Part 4 of Valley of the Flying Dragon. Smash a big rock. Get eaten. And fight some enemies. I think Fina got like two hits in there though, not just one. So that's nice. Yeah. I might even get weapon skill on Gadwin before <laughs> yeah, I get through this. It's pretty good. I can't complain about that at all. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
I do quite like it in this game. You can feel your characters getting stronger though. Like when you get like level ups, like you can see like sometimes you'll go back to an area and the enemies are like not there. Not that these are difficult. These are all fairly good. They're not tough and you can just use them to grind. Here we are. It's a shame, we're just about out now too. Oh, she can take all that in one. Nice, didn't expect that. Oh god, when you missed. It's okay, then he hits for the triple in you. have like the same damage. <laughs> That's so good. Oh no, we're not gonna ambush. No? Nice. Yes, we've got initiative actually. I think uh well I think I was hitting the other one though, wasn't I? Oh, it's good that I should have just to go after this one. Ah, oh, we're back to classic Fina. I thought she was able to take them out. It's okay. I think it's because we were gonna... The rock man would have hit us and we hit this one just in time. No, maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was just pure dumb luck. I don't know if Fina can take these out. <laughs> oh, she's not fire man. That's progress. Rock fall. That's a Pokemon move. But it's okay. This is the last enemy I think we'll fight in this area. How sad. We've seen so many of them. Do you know I used to try and like blast through this game? I used to actually struggle on these plot molds. I remember, oh I didn't want to fight these and the red devils like here yeah, fighting the red devils. It always felt like such a chore. And now here we are. Just like one shot in him. That's uh that's growth that. There we go. Now where are we at to next? We're going to Dite Village. I love the map by the way. I've been looking to try and buy the map for so long and I've never been able to. This is Dite Village. There's an inn right over there, but I thought I'd guide you there, but hmm, what's wrong, Godwin? It's something I noticed earlier. Clouds from the north are black in the sky. Hmm. The sky sure does look strange. Looks like a rainstorm is coming. Hmm. <laughs> Please excuse me, but I must go talk with the Elder. Why don't you have a look at the sights here in Dite Village? Okay. He's gone already. I guess he's in a big hurry. It's strange though. His concern about a rainstorm on the way? Hmm. Let's see. I took us some medicine to Dr. Alma, but it's uh, not nearly enough. Hmm. Gonna have to make a two trips. But you know, everyone gets a better with my medicine. Just warms up my heart and fills up my wallet. But don't you think it's wonderful? Huh? Um, I don't know. I guess. 
Well, everyone is a happy. Isn't that just a wonderful? Oh, wow! A talking rabbit! I can't believe my eyes! Hey, can I touch you just a little? Psst! What's a with you guys? You keep calling me rabbit. Rabbit. From uh, my point of view, you guys are from uh, the other side of the wall. You're the stranger-looking ones. Huh? How did you know that we came across the wall? Who are you? I'm Guido of Zil Padden, a traveling a salesman traveling throughout the world. Guido is so good. Hey, yeah. Uh, you guys didn't know what that old saying, yeah? That is muggy, we uh, like to say. Ha, you know it. I don't care much about old sayings, but I would like you to tell us how you got to know so much about us. They say uh, everyone is born to play a part in life. The same goes for you, Justin. Well, as I said, I don't care much. Here, you even know my name. That's Mogia. We know everything. At me, I'm a Mogia. To be fair, it's better than Moonsaw. Let me go. Guido is very interesting. Now the weapon stores where we after. Hey, I haven't seen you guys around here. So what do you think of my goods? Go ahead, pick up stuff, check it out. And if you've got anything you don't need, turn it in the counter. Well. Wow. Oh, is Gadwin got my mana egg? That's so sad. Okay, so. We're gonna do a trade on that. Um, I'm gonna buy this. And we're gonna do a trade on this one. I don't like that because it's got the heavy trait. So that's like all getting. Oh no, I didn't get armor. Oh, we don't have no gold. And I got the weaker armor. Ah, it's fine, whatever. I'm sure this Fina will be fine. Oh, Jude, did you come to visit me? I just finished treating a patient. I suspect the Typhoon Tower is responsible for those illnesses. I see a lot of patients and my suspicion becomes stronger each day. I don't think I'm mistaken. It's going to get even busier around here later. You folks be sure to get plenty of rest. There we go. Aldo, we're here for big tr we're heading for big trouble here if it starts raining. Right, you are Godwin. But will it really rain? I can't say for sure, but when I look at those clouds, I feel a cold shiver run down my spine. Hmm. Oh, Chew, sorry, I've got more talking to do. It's a rather urgent matter. If you could wait for me over there, I'll join you after I talk with the Elder. Who are you? I'm from Village Elder. Is there something you need? Please excuse us, but we're discussing a crucial matter right now. Would you kindly come back later? Now we'll go back to the inn, I think. Why do I stop at the end? There we go. What's the matter, Gad? When you came back to the end pretty late last night, it seems. Yeah, sat a long talk with another. Uh, things. I'll be alright here as long as it doesn't rain. Rain, did you look outside? It's raining right now. What? Oh no. Gadwin, tell me. Tell me what's going on. Indeed, it is raining. No. What's wrong with Gadwin? So it's raining. So what? I think it's something else. Whatever it is, it's not just a rainstorm. Let's go see. Oh. 
You know, don't you, Gadwin? We've lost the spirit's protection. For seeing at the Typhoon Tower, the earth soaked with poisonous rain, dead rivers stained with ill fortune. Have you witnessed that scene? Yes, of course, I understand. Soon, the poisonous rain will turn red and become the rain of death. To save Dite, we must climb the Typhoon Tower, as the legend says, and bring back the Spear of Heroes. And so I say to you, take this hero's armband and save our village of Dite. I am ready. I can't let all of that training go to waste. But Elder, two heroes are needed to retrieve the Spear of Heroes. If I go by myself, how can I possibly pass the final test? Yes, but you are the only one here. There is no other hero. Hmm, what should I do? Hey, Gadwin, I'll go with you. What? We are just a child. I appreciate your concern, but... So you underestimate him. Just as a man. One who has crossed the wall at the end of the world. What? what? The child? The wall at the end of the world? Justin, the Typhoon Tower is a horrible and dangerous place. Without the Spirit's protection, we may lose our lives. We've never been allowed there, so I must ask you, do you still wish to go? If I were afraid of danger, how could I call myself an adventurer? And besides, we made a promise, man to man, to help each other whenever the need arises. Ha <laughs> ha you're right. We did swear to each other, man to man, and up between friends. Sir, as in the legend, two warriors stand before you, ready to save the village of Dite. Yes, so now it is decided. In that case, allow me to bestow upon you the legendary hero's armband. On its rightful honour it will shine. Let the spirits guide the two heroes of Dite. Justin, are you sure you want to go? Of course I'm sure, we made a promise man to man. Hey, <laughs> look Fina, don't I look cool? What's all this about man to man promise? Someone calls you a hero and you let go to your head. If you're that reckless about sticking your neck into danger, you're just a second, no, a third rate adventurer. What's your problem Fina? Why are you so upset about it? It's not like you. That's right, what's bothering you? Challenging danger is part of being an adventurer, isn't it? It's okay, everything will be fine, just as it's always been, right? Justin. Alright Justin, we're all agreed, so let's get going. Our destination, the Typhoon Tower lies to the North Dyke Village. Typhoon Tower? Well, quite obviously, we're going to do that next time. Because I've been for a bit, I had some internet issues and I want to try and sort them out to make sure that I don't keep dropping frames. I haven't dropped any since then, but it is pretty worrying and I want to try and fix it for the next time, so yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please watch again, or, you know, just at least, like, watch of my blog. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, yes, it's, I just really enjoy this game. I'm so happy to be playing it again, and I got distracted by other games getting released, and I feel like it's a disservice because I genuinely want to finish this game. It's one of my favourites and I'm not going to let it keep getting stopped and held up. Anyway, on that note, let's just call it there. I hope you've enjoyed. Bye bye!